Morning. Um, it's like 11.30. We had room service for breakfast, just like cereal, fruit, muffins, pastries, or whatever. It's all right. Um, the milk I got was warm, so I didn't even eat the cereal. It's in the fridge. It's a sea day, lazy sea day so far. We're going to do another pub crawl, but uh, we're not into filming. So <laughs> we're not doing anything until dinner. We got a zoomie for dinner, and so we're going to show everything into Zoomy, check that out of the meal plan. But uh, maybe I'll do a drunken room tour after the pub crawl. Hopefully there's more drinking today than the last pub crawl. It seemed like very low key. But it's a smaller group and we know everybody, so it should be fun. Anyway, we're off. Our room is still okay, but a little messy. Um, we didn't have a room steward come in yesterday because, I don't know, we're pretty clean anyway. But uh, well, I guess that's it. Um, See you at dinner. No one's gonna see your fat chin with your hand there. Right, easy. We just ordered, so we have the package. So it's the prefix you get, the soup, and then an app, and two rolls each. Um, for us, that's a lot of rice, that's a lot of sushi. So we did order four rolls. Um, the futomaki, who's been recommended by pretty much everyone who we talked to who's been here. I'm probably not even talking loud enough. There's live music somewhere. It has cream cheese though. I'm not sure about the cream cheese. He's not, but it's been so recommended that he's gonna try it. But apparently, that's the one that's big like that. Yeah, it's huge. It's, it's like a three biter. It's only gonna be a little bit of cream cheese. Yeah, so we're gonna try it. Anyways, we have four rolls. Like we, we, would, we would probably not even finish two rolls completely between the two of us. So we did a pub crawl. I'm a little drunky. A little. So I... Jay, I, I cut Jason off for a bit. Coke. Well, whatever. We wanted to hang out tonight, so yeah, I, I've like, stopped. Yeah, we started drinking at... You started drinking at noon. And like vodka sodas. And if you guys know Jason, he doesn't drink vodka. So he's pounded about 10 vodka sodas. In like a decent amount of time though, when I you wish think I counted because I, I think I'm beating Carnival today. I think I'm Yo, you, I think you beat Carnival right now. I think you're like at 13, 14. So he's having pop with dinner. And oh, I wish I had a menu to like reread what we ordered. So there's the futomaki, and uh, there's a spicy, crispy salmon, there's a tuna, and then he, uh, the baked something. I, We'll Google this stuff, we'll write it in, and we'll obviously give our, you know, out of 10 with our little comments. And we'll do pictures or film. Hopefully it's not too loud in here. We'll do pic we'll do film, because yeah. like I don't know how much we're doing after dinner. Oh, and not much. Yeah, he's almost done. You're lucky you're here tonight, actually. My arm's getting tired. You're <laughs> all right. So we'll film dinner. Okay, okay. And but no, when you're with friends, I don't want to. No. Well, no, we're having fun. And, like, this isn't our job, so. That's right. Yeah. You're, you're not priority. That's not. So that's the fried rice in the appetizer portion. That's a lot of fried rice. It's a lot. I, I was going to say that that's, like, not too big. Like, it. yes, it's a lot because it's rice and it's sushi. But spring roll, this is a shared appetizer to me. Yeah. Which we will share. Hopefully. If I'm nice, I'm gonna, and then... If you're nice, I, it's my appetizer. I'm going to share. Yeah, if I'm nice, I get some. Oh, yeah, okay, sorry. Oh, dear. Guys, it's going to be a long night. And I wanted the miso soup. It smells amazing, the miso soup. Yeah, it does. You can smell yeah, it. Yeah, you can smell from here. It's legit. And then Jason is also going to get a miso soup. So, spring rolls, actually, it's tasty, but it's, there's cream cheese in there. Yeah. Which is an odd thing. So it's warm. Oh yeah, hot cream cheese. Because you hate the warm cream cheese. No. I don't like, I don't eat cream cheese really. No, he doesn't. But it's, uh, it's so good, but it's, it's odd. I wasn't expecting cream cheese there. But it still tastes, tastes good. Oh. Soup's here. Miso soup. Thank you very much. There you go. Yeah, so he wouldn't even eat the cold cream cheese and I was saying with that firecracker shrimp and then the futomaki who has cream cheese and we had it on the pizza yeah, yesterday. Yeah, yesterday, yeah. It's like a lot of cream cheese. Your cream cheese, that you're good for like yeah. another five years before you want cream cheese. Well, 
five months. Can you show me the inside of that, actually? Well, you can see the cream cheese there. Oh, wait, can you take a bite? Is it too hot? I won't get that on camera. There you go. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ooh. Back up. There's cream cheese inside. Yeah, oh, you can see it. So I skipped a little, I didn't bite in. Or yeah, well. Yeah, so I pulled out. Here's the remnants. Yeah, but it's, it's good. So I've tried the miso, the shrimp, and the firecracker shrimp. Um, yeah, see, I didn't care as for the cream cheese in there either. I felt like it made the the crispy layer not as crispy. But the sauce is good, and it, like it's a nice piece of shrimp. It's but, still a nice. Wait, if you pull the shrimp out <laughs> like that in the sauce, is awesome. It's really good. Mm -hmm. And I added soy sauce to this, and like it's okay. I just panicked, anyways. She didn't realize ever got miso on the package. So then I was like, uh, 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 fried rice, but like we don't need that much rice. That's so much rice. And but in the appetizer, the miso soup is the winner. I usually find I'm adding soy sauce to make it saltier or to my liking, and I added nothing. It was perfect just the way it was. That's my favorite. Round one. Can you uh, turn that a little bit? So the spicy, crispy shrimp. Turn it well, like. Uh, like, just so I can see the inside. Wait, wait, let's go this way. So, spicy, crispy shrimp. Oh, oh. The Fruto Mac We have a blogger here. There you go. We have the dynamite. Dynamite right? roll. Baked salmon and snow crab dynamite. And what's that one? Sorry. Seared tuna tataki. Seared tuna tataki. Oh, I love it. It looks gorgeous. Thank you. Please enjoy. Can you turn that one? I want to see the inside. Please. No, baby. It's like. Or grab it. There's not a lot of space. I know. There you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's perfect. Awesome. Look at this is a piece of art. Do I even want to eat that? I want to eat Just that. kidding. Yeah, we are. There's like a uh, fried crispy onion. Crispy onion in there. Yeah, that's like a four biter for me anyways. Yeah, I prefer smaller ones, but whatever. It looks good. Digging in. So mid-meal update. We've tried them all. Um, I don't even know what I had. But like tuna, whatever. Seared tuna. It was amazing. Amazing. Shrimp, something. Um, spicy. Spicy, spicy shrimp. Spicy, crispy oh. shrimp. It was so good. Really good. I think the spicy shrimp is the best one. Seared tuna is the best one. Yeah. Second best. And then you're into these ones. Futamaki is good. I'm not a cream cheese guy. Yeah, so we're having both issues with the cream cheese. So we followed the recommendation for this one. That would be the fourth one. Uh, it's not. Which I didn't read it. He just recommended and I was, oh, it's not for a second. We were just all on board. It also has cream cheese. And I didn't know, the, the salmon's cooked in it. I'm not a fan no. of cooked salmon in a sushi. Well, it takes away from the texture. Sushi shouldn't be cooked anymore. And the taste. So, yeah, but. Those two are amazing. We are gonna finish that one as well. And this one, if you guys want it, it's probably still here. And wait, our waiter's awesome. Yes, he's amazing. Extra, extra coat without even asking. Oh, and I'm yeah, I got the Kim Crawford Sauvignon Blanc, and my glass never got empty. Yeah, so same thing. Pour, 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 fill, pour. Fill. But that's the drink. Am I on or no? Yeah, that's the drink package. Yeah, that's the drink package. Fill it up with Odie. When they see you have the drink package, they got heavy pours that's out not here. That's true though. No, no. Not every waiter's done that. He's, uh, he's yeah, been good so But far. like the pours, like the vodkas and whatever, like it, this is free pour. It's not the counted one. No, I meant not every waiter brings the drinks up without asking. No, but there's more. NBR didn't do that. No MDR, that's a different vibe though. Uh, still nursing that, that's good. I don't, yeah. It's still fried rice. I'm still regretting that choice, but that's okay. 
Yeah. So this is the reason why do. we don't fit do we? So we love that piano guy. Okay. Let me, let me see what he is. Interesting. I'm going to try to get you some of these. songs that should never ever be played together. saw the comedy show, we went to the piano bar, we went to the club, which it was like super busy. I've never seen a club cruise ship that busy. There must have been like over a hundred people in there, but it's a big venue. Um, we were out till 3. 3.30? 3.30. Is that with the time change? No. So it was 4.30 for us, but we lost an hour, so it was 3.30. <sighs> So, I went to the bathroom, and then staff, I bumped in staff, and they're like, good, oh, morning. good morning. Yeah. I'm like, good morning. They're like, it's 3.30. Uh, it's 4.30. It's yeah, good yeah. morning. And uh, we wanted Sorrento's, but that was closed, so I'm not sure if that's like a, because the cruise is almost over. Uh, Cafe Promenade, right next to it, was open with little sandwiches. I had their little egg sandwich. I didn't take a picture or anything, but it was really good really good that really hit the spot at 4 30 in the morning eggs is what you eat in the morning anyways amy got a cookie amy got a cookie rock oh hard. rock hard and then she went and got another one she could like she was using her molars and couldn't even bite into it it was 4 30 in the morning though like do we really need fresh cookies uh we're at fish and chips it's our first time trying it so how the menu works it's from 11 30 to 5 every day I believe, not just sea days. I think it's every day. And there's some things on the menu that are free, like I think the cod sandwich, which I'm seeing going around a lot and it looks really good. So that would be included, like that's free. Cod and chips. Cod and chips, that would be free. Halibut and chips you pay. Halibut, you're... and then there's, a, I think there's a lobster roll. Yeah, halibut and chips like $5, lobster roll is like 10. I think I'm gonna do the lobster roll because it's good, I think. I don't know, this is our first time here. And so I'm just waiting for Monica and Joe. They're going to join us for lunch. And then we're going to do maybe outdoor hot tub. It's getting warmer. We're getting closer to home. This is the last day and it's a sea day. The seas aren't as rough as yesterday. I got two patches on and I'm eating the tablets from guest services. And I was still barely making it out alive yesterday. Uh, yeah, we're gonna do the hot tub and we're just gonna relax. Solarium. Solarium, but Jason wants to do the outdoor ones. Maybe uh, Leaf Game at the bar later. Oh, that's right, Leaf Game. 7.30 Toronto time. So we're still three hours. 4.30. 4.30. Oh, and then we have no dinner reservations tonight. But I think we were talking yesterday of trying to get like a big table for 10 and trying to get as many people from like the pub crawls because we've done two pub crawls now and I think Scott was wanted to do another one today. Are you Scott about? and Kirsten, they wanted to do another one which I'm totally down. I'm not over because your girl stayed away from sugary drinks because she learned her lesson after three horrible hangovers on this cruise. Stayed away from the sugar drinks. I just did like some wine with dinner but I got the Kim Crawford that I know has less than two grams of sugar per liter and vodka sodas. And I gave myself one espresso martini because they're just so good. And like, it's good either before dinner or after dinner, just like a little pick me up. Alexa Mace is the best one. She's the cutest little thing. Where's she from, Romania? So. She's a little blonde. She's the cutest thing ever. Bartend, when we walk bartender by, bartender in schooner. Yes, bartender in schooner, Alexa. Yeah, she, her husband's in engineering. Yeah, her husband's in engineering, and he keeps telling us that they're gonna fix the North Star, that it's fixed, but it's not. Apparently, they're getting drunk. 
which I'm totally okay with because we weren't gonna do the North Star anyway, so I'm gonna let them live their best life because I'm living my best life. I don't wanna get off tomorrow. No. But yeah, we get off tomorrow, day eight, or is it, is it day nine, kind day nine. of. It's technically day nine tomorrow when we get off in Seattle and we fly out at 1.30, but we have a layover in Chicago and we don't land in Toronto Pearson till like a lot midnight, yeah. almost midnight. We lose three hours. We yeah. Minute, ugh, yeah, so I don't even think we're getting our puppy tomorrow because I don't want to wake them up and that's an awkward time to show up and take my dog and leave. She, uh, Sophie's that Jason's sister. Thank you, Lisa and Jamie. Oh. So since it was our only time, we wanted to try as many things as possible. So I got the lobster, ta royal lobster tail. Uh, so that one was ten dollars. You get two tails with chips, and it's a lime and chili, no lime and something. So I can eat lime cilantro. The Pollock sandwich. Thanks, babe. Ooh, that's a piece. And Jason got the fish and chips. What's up? They, there was quite a bit of meat on the lobster. You get two. And so, yeah, it's a lime and cilantro kind of tartar sauce. That was very nice. And how's your fish and chips, babe? Yeah? And his was I like the fish, or chips better than the fish. And I would go extra chips. Extra chips, yeah, extra chips wouldn't hurt. And the Pollock sandwich, well, after eating my lobster tail, I wasn't the biggest fan of the Pollock sandwich, but like that's a big piece of fish, like that's a nice piece. So yeah, we enjoyed that. Now we're gonna chill in the solarium, which is adults only, and the best view of the ship. 270 is pretty good, but there's no palm trees. And and there were pool and hot tubs. So we're gonna hit those today. Oh, and your girl has started drinking mimosa. And we were counting yesterday because we want to beat uh, Carnival's cheers package. We definitely. Jason thinks he beats it. He beat it at least three times on this cruise. No. No. Three times, but I definitely definitely it. twice definitely. yesterday. And so did I. I think I was over 18 drinks yesterday. So. My first soft serve. Ding. Cheers. <laughs> Look how cute. He got it like nailed it perfect. Ooh, it looks big next to my head. I swear it's not that big, guys. Chocolate. Chocolate only. So Jason didn't get any. He got a Bloody Mary extra spicy. And he says it's really spicy. Is it even good? You don't even like Bloody Mary. It's good. Mm. It's not as good as Caesar, but it's good. Oh, that's good. Yeah. And we didn't bring a speaker? I love chocolate, but I Babe, there's something on your leg. Hold on, come here. Go away, buddy. Oh, I was wondering what the, I thought you cut yourself. Oh, it was a fly? How that's many gross. flies here? <laughs> I guess we were by the mountain now. How pretty. Oh no, Roxanne, <laughs> you didn't. <laughs> what the fuck did you film that? I am filming. filming. Guys. And it's sliding as the wave <laughs> as the boat moves. Guys, my whole freaking ice cream. Hold on, am I getting it? It went and it splashed right on the floor and it's moving. Look at it! Aw oh, man. I guess I have this much left. I guess I'll have to get another one later. We tried to go to cruise next, but I didn't know. We left it to the last minute and you need an appointment to get in on the last day. So we are at, at 270 at the back of the ship. Look at that beautiful wake. 
It's about three o'clock. Yeah, it's about three o'clock. We got that good shaved roast beef sandwich with horseradish. We're getting a drink at the bar and we're gonna go to, go to the room. We're gonna pack. And, oh yeah, I wanna try to get a reservation for the MDR for like eight people for tonight. And yeah, we're just gonna pack, relax a little bit. We had such an awesome time in the outdoor hot tub. It was so hot and sunny, it was beautiful. We tanned a little bit. Tickle, tickle. Look at that. So they do a little slab of gravy on the bottom and horseradish. So good. Thank you. So we got our drinks, our sandwiches. We're up to the room. Jason want to watch the game tonight. Puck drop in an hour and a half. 4.30. We lost an hour, so we're still even more. 3.13. Hour twenty. Puck drop in an hour and twenty. We lost an hour last night. Whew. Okay. We're almost in Vancouver. We I can know. see Vancouver. Jason's surprised that we're actually sitting out in our wet bathing suits in the sun on the balcony, but we've been seeing Vancouver Island since noon. So like we're I think we're in Canada now. Uh, the captain said we'd be crossing over the U.S. at 8 p.m. tonight. And but the signs say it's nine degrees. So it's, it's not like nine degrees. 48, 48 degrees, and it's it's way warmer than that. This feels like we're in the Caribbean. Well, like it's hot. We're in our wet bathing suits. Yeah. And it's it's like it's hot. It's comfortable. These coffees block the wind really well. Yeah, there's no wind. Cheers. So we're gonna enjoy that. Pack. And we have we're going to dinner with four other people. We don't have a reservation, but you don't need one on my time. So we went for cruise next. Did you say? You need yeah, I said. Yeah. But then they were like very like apologetic and they're trying to figure it out and they're like, well, we don't have appointments between the 5 to 6 hour, like p.m. because that's their lunch break and they just alternate so they're like, try to come now. And then the girl's like, I'll, I'll stay a little later after my last appointment at 9, so if you guys want to come in. Because like we're used to Norwegian where you just buy the cruise next certificate. So it's like how much money of certificates do you want to buy? And it takes. Oh, it's 30 bit. seconds. Yeah. Like it's 30 seconds unless you have no idea how the program works, then it's three minutes tops. On Royal, you're booking an actual cruise, like the whole vacation. Yeah, so for dates, rooms, yeah, yeah. ships, so, a bit. so it could be a while. Yeah, like you're, it's like you, think about with it. the travel agent, so it takes quite a while like he said it could be up to 30 minutes with one appointment yeah. so we're gonna try to do her go go find her at 9 p.m. we should be done dinner and the piano guy should not have started we're doing again schooner at the piano bar that is just so much fun and I mean well you I we weren't filming we stopped filming you know when it gets ugly uh, apparently I was dancing. I don't dance. Two nights ago, yeah. Two nights ago I was dancing in the piano bar and they were there last night. I didn't recognize them. Yeah, there was an Asian group and they were all, they were playing the... Yeah, the, the they have shaky instrument, Mar instruments. Maracas kind of thing. And yeah, so when I walk by them, they're like, hey! Like, wh and I'm like, what, who? Hi, what's up? So that was really funny. Yeah. And then we're like, yeah, you were dancing. And they were singing and laughing. And yeah. Were they dancing? Dancing? I don't remember dancing. But anyway, yeah. Yeah. So that's, that's a good time. A few too many drinks. Uh, what was I going to say? Yeah, let's see. Let's see. Okay, let's see.